Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we'll dive into the fascinating story behind one of the most controversial and misunderstood sculptures in the United States, the Blue Mustang at Denver International Airport. Is it an evil demon horse or does it hold a deeper meaning? Let's find out. The Blue Mustang, sometimes referred to as Lucifer has been a topic of debate ever since its installation in 2008. Many travelers have been unnerved by the sculpture's fierce appearance and red glowing eyes. Lucifer has to endure extreme weather of hail, rain, and particularly high winds that come with Colorado's weather conditions. However, the artist behind this work aimed to convey the power and freedom of the American Mustang, not evil intentions. The sculpture's imposing stance and fierce expression are intended to evoke the untamed nature of the Mustangs that once roamed the vast plains of the American West. These horses, renowned for their resilience and adaptability, have been admired for their ability to thrive in the face of adversity. By portraying the Blue Mustang in such a striking manner, the creator aimed to capture the essence of these noble creatures and inspire a sense of awe and wonder in those who view the peace. Additionally, the vibrant blue hue of the Mustang is a nod to the artist's penchant for using bold colors to create a sense of depth and emotion in his work. This choice of color is meant to grab the viewer's attention and encourage a deeper appreciation for the sculpture's underlying message of freedom and perseverance. Born in El Paso, Texas on July 30, 1940, Luis Jimenez was an artist who focused on Hispanic themes and social commentary using bold, bright colors in his artwork. Passing away on June 13, 2006, Luis Jimenez was remembered a talented American sculptor and graphic artist with Mexican roots who embraced his Chicano identity. His artwork is recognized for depicting Mexican, Southwestern, Hispanic American, and various other subjects in his public commissions, some of which are specifically designed for certain locations. With his most renowned works, The Mustang, commissioned by the Denver International Airport and finished after his passing. The Mustang was commissioned in 1993, but it faced numerous delays and lawsuits causing its installation to be postponed until 2008. One of the primary reasons for the legal issues was the lengthy duration it took to complete the project, which far exceeded the original timeline. As a result, tensions rose between the involved parties, leading to a series of lawsuits that further prolonged the process. Additionally, Luis Jimenez's traditional approach to creating sculptures, which involved time-consuming techniques such as mold-making, played a role in the delays. Jimenez repeatedly missed deadlines and the city of Denver filed a lawsuit against him to get the money back. His commitment to maintaining artistic integrity and staying true to his vision was commendable, but it also contributed to the project's slow process, causing frustration among stakeholders. On June 13, 2006, at the age of 65, Jimenez tragically passed away in his Hondo, New Mexico studio. The unfortunate accident occurred while he was working on his 32-foot-tall, 9,000-pound Blue Mustang sculpture, which was destined for Denver Airport. A sizable portion of the artwork unexpectedly detached from a hoist, resulting in a severed artery in Jimenez's leg and ultimately resulted in his untimely demise. The Blue Mustang was intended to capture the spirit of the plains where wild mustangs once roamed. 
Contrary to popular belief, the sculpture is not a monument to the Denver Broncos, but rather than an embodiment of strength, freedom, and independence associated with Mustangs. Now that we've explored the artist's background and intentions, we invite you to reconsider your perception of this striking work of art. Do you still think the Blue Mustang is an evil demon horse? Or can you now appreciate it as a tribute to the power and freedom of the American Mustang? Thank you for joining us on this journey to unravel the mystery behind Denver's Blue Mustang. Let us know your thoughts on this unique sculpture in the comments below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more intriguing stories. Until next time. Stay curious.